All right, so in this problem, we are given a series of numbers and we want to know what the next number in our series will be. So let's take a look at our transitions. Moving from negative 3 to positive 1, we had to add 4. Moving from 1 to negative 2, we had to subtract 3. Moving from negative 2 to negative 1, we added 1. And moving from negative 1 to negative 3, we had to subtract 2. All right, now this pattern seems to be a little bit inconsistent, so let's try to be a little creative and see what our pattern could be. We can tell that if we take 4 and 3 and we add them together, we get positive 1. When we take negative 3 and positive 1 and add them together, we get a negative 2. So this pattern is going to be when you add the last two transitions, you get the next transition. So if we take 1 and negative 2 and we add them together, we get negative 1. So that's going to be our next transition. So we have, if we do negative 3 minus 1, we get negative 4, which will be the next number in our series.